the reason why no magician does it like that is fucking impossible. <laughs> Danger! <laughs> oh my god, you did something! <laughs> And when you 
did that, like it's still, I mean, it's, it's still palming your right hand like that. Then I'll do this maneuver slowly because I did it foot fast last time. <laughs> <laughs> Now you've got the fake pieces in front and then the torn pieces behind. And when you open up, when you count to ten, I'll just do it quickly because we're, we're running out of time. I'll go one, two, you hide the torn pieces behind, like that, and then you go, oh my god, look at me, I'm a legend. I'm a legend, look at me. But if you're really good, count again. Go. One, two, three. Whoa, no way! Six, seven. Yes, you really did both of them. Now you learn nothing. I'm going to show you. I'm going to show you. This is a classic. I'm going to explain one more trick for you. Across the sparky. Shuffling it, keeping it at the back, right like that. That's all I was doing, just fake shuffling it. And then I, I, I stole the card. Oh, oh. <laughs> and I gave the card back. And then when I went in, I used it. I went into the room. Now I'm going to use. I'm going to use. I'm going to use a see through balloon. So once you've got the card, you've got it back like that. You've got to put it on the back of the balloon like that, just in case. Somebody comes from the back of the kitchen or something. Oh, look, who's going to come in the back? Come up again. Get to the front. You should be in the front of the party anyway. And then you, that's it. And then when you burst a balloon, you go, oh, my God. But if you're really good, you just give it a bit of a blow. Michael, give it a bit of a blow. You rub it a bit, a bit of moisture. <laughs> too good, too good. Um, ladies and gentlemen, uh, this is, uh, look, we, we didn't quite get through everything. Um, and when I finished, and I, I've got a few uh, social media things to finish on. Uh, but um, good luck, Connor. Thanks to everyone for playing up. Uh, you know, good luck with the whole uh, family thing and marriage and all that sort of stuff. It's not easy. It's not easy because, you know, there's a lot of things he's got to look forward to, ladies and gentlemen. Does he not? A lot of things. Um, kids, you know, family, wedding, all that sort of stuff. Uh, kids have superpowers; they just their hands get sticky. And um, you got you'll be you'll be um, a couple of books I can help you with. 
One's called repeating myself. <laughs> You've all read that one? That one's called picking pick that shit up. Third one, my favorite. Fuck, Lego hurts when you step on it. <laughs> That's the best ever. The best. And like, you know what? Who's got teenagers? Anybody got teenagers? Yeah, yeah this is the best time to get a dog, isn't it? <laughs> when you have teenagers, best time to get a dog, so when you come home, at least somebody is happy to see you. <laughs> We do, we, yeah, we do strange things like, uh, um, and also, ladies and gentlemen, um, we, human beings, like, we get asked, we, we get weird scenarios, put in weird scenarios. We all get through, like, you know, I mean, police have a great, I've got a few police friends, right, and they've got a tough job, uh, but they're going to ask stupid jobs. Are there, uh, are there any police officers here tonight? They don't come to the jobs. Because <laughs> they ain't going to ask dumb questions, why were you speeding? Why? Were you speeding? And then there's an opportunity for you to come up with an answer. <laughs> I love that. Like you now, people, people, like any scenario, situation, people like the like people don't pick up a private number. True? People see a private number because it's human beings. That's what our behaviour is. Private number. No, I'm not gonna pick up. Not me. I love it. Private number. Yeah, I know they're not family or friends. I'm all over it. Hello, you've run this bird back. <laughs> New jacket, we pack it, how am I help you? <laughs> you can do you want, it's up to you. I love that. So yeah, good luck with that. Like, but like, police, when a police officer pulls me over and says, uh, why were you spinning? I always answer in the accent they think my head should speak in. <laughs> why were you spinning? Oh my God, look, what's that? I can't hear that. How much like, does your head drive safety? I was like, this is a record. I'm like, Why are you speeding? Like, what do you mean? I'm like, I've got five guys waiting on my deals. <laughs> why are you speeding? Somebody like, well, what happened to your window, window, window wipers? Like, windscreen wipers. Like, what do you mean? They're not there. <laughs> yeah, why, why aren't they there? So I don't get any parking tickets. <laughs> Good idea, I don't tell anybody. Do you have any drugs on you? Yeah, what do you need? <laughs> you might as well have a laugh, that's the whole point. Go out with a laugh, come out with a bang range and now, uh, we do have to like, wrap it up. We did get through everything because you guys were amazing. Uh, your support has been incredible. Um, and once we finish right at the end, uh, we just go crazy again. Uh, you know, just stand up. I'll just pretend. Uh, you, you stand up to leave, but I'll pretend as a standing ovation. Because <laughs> <laughs> they get carried away, ladies and gentlemen. We, we saw a bit of improv tonight, uh, some stand up, some mucking around, some shit magic. Uh, so you saw different sort of, you know, a comedian doing different sort of skill sets on stage, so I hope you appreciate it. I want to finish with like um, social media, right? Because this is where we as human beings were the weirdest because as social media, oh my God, the big worldwide internet. What if, as human beings, what have we reduced it to? Hmm? Shit. Porn <laughs> and scams, unfortunately. <laughs> that's it, porn and scams, that's what we reduce. You can search up anything you like, and we just try to trick each other. Like, so you've got to be a little bit careful with that. Um, keep an eye for each other. Like, and scams. Oh my God, I don't have people fall for it. The king of Nigeria has got one billion dollars. <laughs> and some human beings are like, fuck, does he? How do I get it? All you have to do is give you a credit card. <laughs> Hand over three grand. People fought for it. Like, I mean, obviously, we don't, we've got to warn for it. Like, people fought for it. Like, and the other thing is, like, you know, uh, so look, I mostly, because um, I've been doing comedy for quite a while, I've been sitcoms and movies, different stuff. So I get, look, you know, the support I get has been incredible. And I thank you tonight, like, for turning up and supporting me. This is the uh, second show. The first one sold out. This, so this is the tour I've finished. So this will be the last one I do this show. But I'll be back next year with a big show, a two hour show that'll be touring all over Australia. Uh, about my whole career, uh, there'll be sort of uh, stuff about pizza and houses and hiccup and all sorts of things. So hopefully um, you can check that out. 
Uh, when I was in the jungle, there'd be all sorts of stuff, stories and vision and footage, but hopefully when you see that, come out and uh, check it out, and I love your support. But um, the feedback I get sometimes, right? Most is pretty good, right? And I, I've been doing it for so long, so I don't really care anymore, right? But so, sometimes, this, this was the, uh, this was a Turkish guy giving me, like, you know, <laughs> he wasn't happy with me, right? And some people just go, oh my God, they, as I said, 99% are really positive and I love it, and, and for some people, like, you know, I don't mind when people give feedback, but, uh, you know, bullies and stupid trolls, you know, nobody's got time for it. But this guy, he, he sort of wanted to criticise me, but he wasn't sure. <laughs> And this is what he wrote, and I loved it. And I, I, I've been sharing all these shows like, you know, I've got heaps of them, like, I don't find you one bit funny. You're trying to make money from criticizing your own culture, which is totally exaggerated. Maybe not for you, depending on where you come from in Turkey. <laughs> <laughs> and then he carries on, right? Shame on you. I recommend you find other subjects, other subjects to do your stand ups. But still with a personality accident of yours, good luck. <laughs> <laughs> this is, ladies and gentlemen, this is uh, something that went viral, I'm going to share with you. I get a message last year, 5.13 a.m. <laughs> Pay attention. That's what I mean, I don't know who's up, but like, this guy's up and he goes, I'm going to send Tahir a message. <laughs> And his message was, I've never liked anything you did. <laughs> all right, all right, fair enough. You can see, I tell you, come in, so follow me on Instagram and Facebook, just check it like, really crazy. So I replied back, because I love this for a shit. I said, okay, no problem, but not even one thing. <laughs> Fair enough, right? I've done like sitcoms and stuff and stage shows and live shows. And then he replied back and he got angry. Because why are you pestering again? You're not funny. You've already worked out that he sent me the first message. <laughs> then I replied back. Okay, but what do you mean pestering? Did you not send me the first message? He blocked me. <laughs> I don't know what to do with that sort of stuff. I'm going to share the purpose of my laugh. So, look, enjoy yourselves. I hope you see you again in my shows. Um, and be careful of, like, uh, scams. Very, very thing. Like, you know, and especially, like, us men, we get, like, you know, scams all the time. And it's, it's like, I don't know, but no wonder, like, guys feel bad. You look after each other's mental health. Oh, yeah? Reach out, reach out to each other. Reach out. No? And it says reach out. Reach out. Reach out. Help each other. Like, you know, ask them. We get like, you know what happened? I'll tell you, like, I'm going to leave you on this, right? Men get messages like this. Well, do you want a bigger penis? <laughs> so, one of these messages, right? I don't like, and I get intrigued. So like other people should delete, delete it, right? Because your mind just worked like my mind. Now, I was like, okay, he said, you want a bigger penis, right? You can get a bigger penis in seconds. <laughs> seconds, scientifically proven, no, not invasive. I got intrigued. <laughs> Send me 20 bucks. Yeah. You know what I did? I said the 20 bucks. I thought, what can happen? I was just going to send the 20 bucks. Probably a scam. Doesn't matter. Whatever happens, happens. Oh, I just got to trace the what happens. But guess what? I got something back. I did. I got something back for my 20 bucks. I'm going to show you. Just let, let this be a lesson. <laughs> Thanks so much, ladies and gentlemen. See you again. I love you all. Come on!